Hey guys, the following is a clip from my interview with Metallica producer Fleming Rasmussen, the producer behind Ride the Lightning, Master of Puppets, and Injustice for All. If you want to see the full interview, it's linked below. You know, Kirk, he's of course famous for various reasons, one of them being his use of the wah pedal. From your experience, does he approach the wah pedal in a unique way? I, I think he's one of the few people in the world where, where it kind of becomes a part of his body. <laughs> Uh, I think I think he uses it pretty well. I'm I'm a big fan. That's that's one of the other things we wanted to do was was you know do diff change the sound during the solos, which not a lot of people did. You know that they, they play a solo and and that it would be the same so sound from start to beginning. We did a lot of experimenting by doing you know changing sounds and even you know putting harmonies on on some parts and then coming back to the originals and stuff like that. And that's one of the reasons why everything is so well documented in terms of sounds because you know we sometimes you, you had to come back to the sound you started with at the end of the solo and we everything would be changed around like 15 times during the solo so yeah i mean uh but i mean his his wild work is fantastic i love when he starts doing that is there any one solo of kirk's that sticks out to you the end solo on one is in my opinion top three in in terms of guitar solos in the world do you remember recording one? Yeah. What was that experience like? It was, uh, I, I liked it. I thought it was uh, one of the best songs that they've ever done.